Hi guys, hello and welcome to Game Fix. And in this episode, we enter week five of this epic rivalry between The Rock and Hulk Hogan. And as you can see in the visuals, how the rivalry started and how it has grown in the last few weeks. The Rock, as we saw in the last episode, gave a beating to Hulk Hogan after his victory, which the immortal superstar was not happy about. The following week, we saw Hulk Hogan chokeslam The Rock after his win over Jerry the King Lawler. And now the duo face each other once again in the ring. And we will cover week number six in this episode as well. So stay tuned to see what happens in these couple of weeks. As in the next episode, we will move to the conclusion of this rivalry during SummerSlam. So to all the viewers who are watching this video, thank you so much. Please subscribe if you haven't. I hope you enjoy this video. Thank you for watching. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Miami, Florida. Weighing in at 275 pounds, The Rock. Take a look at the talent in competition here. You can see exactly why the WWE Universe is so amped up for this one. Gentlemen, Hulkamania is about to run wild. There is only one, the Immortal. And his opponent from Venice Beach, California, weighing in at 303 pounds, the Immortal, H Hogan. Hero to generations, a beacon of hope to young Hulkamaniacs like uh, one Brian Kelly. Yeah. Oh, I know that guy. Hulk Hogan created an entire paradigm shift, transcends sports entertainment. Now, this is a superstar coming into this one with a major chip on his shoulder. Feels like he's not gotten the respect from the division that he's deserved lately. Yeah, but respect has to be earned in matches like this, not just handed out. If he can prove himself here, maybe he will get the respect he believes he deserves. Gonna have to dig down deep here tonight. And then you have the immortal Hulk Hogan, a man who honestly needs no introduction. The picture of perseverance and bringing the fight to his opponents. And all I don't like the looks of this on the second row. Almost took the What a ram drag. That move on its own will knock the wind out of you, but from that height, it'll knock the earth and fire out of you too. He's taking this to the floor now. Uh-oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Suplex! Two! Oh, what a Samoan drop! Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Five. Oh, back of the elbow. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Oh. Hoist it up. Bang. Snap suplex. As we saw there, Hogan's not the only one in this matchup who can bring the fight with authority. Authority, no two ways about it. Oh, what a close line! Oh, man! All right, that's it. Go, go, go! 
Oh, this is not good at all. The pendulum backbreaker stretch. Elbow drop. Couple of them connecting. And then a little... When someone's reputation precedes them like Hogan's does, how important does the mental aspect of this game become? It cannot be overstated. When you're up against one of the greats, defeat can become a self-fulfilling prophecy. But Hogan can be defeated. Just meet him head on. Try to think of him as an opponent and not as the immortal Hulk Hogan. And half of the work is done. Sequence of reversals here. Both superstars clearly studied game tape ahead of time. Oh, a slam. Climbing the turnbuckle now. From the top. Submission locked in tight, nowhere to go, no escape, this could... Bear hug! Well placed elbow, we'll get you out of it. That might be enough, yes it is! Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. So finally the immortal Hulk Hogan has a victory over The Rock and now let's move to week 6 of this rivalry as The Rock and Hulk Hogan get into a brawl outside the ring. Let's see who knocks whom out as they will meet one last time tonight before 
culminating their rivalry during SummerSlam in the next episode. This is the no DQ match. You can tell these superstars have been eagerly awaiting this. They wanted to duke it out in a no limit situation. So now, if they can think it, they can do it. Gets him with the counter. Reciprocating the initial reversal. And what need is there to go looking under the apron like this? And he's going with the great equalizer here, the steel chair. Thrown back in under the ropes. Load up. Uh oh. What a counter by Hogan. Oh my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Vicious right forearm. Oh, what a nasty knee lift. Taking this to the floor. Quick return to the ring. And Hogan gets stonewalled. Oh, back elbow. Oh my God, a steel chair. Corey, what's your best shot at winning in a no disqualification match? You lean into the stipulation and leave no stone unturned. Use everything at your disposal to get the win. Otherwise, what's the point? Oh. And we might be seeing a competitor crumbling before our very eyes. Yeah. How's that for a counter? Quick exchange, reversing the reversal. Oh, caught by the back elbow. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. Ooh, that can knock you out. And Hogan falling victim to a slew of offense. Hogan's gonna have to dig down deep here. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. Uh oh, this isn't going to be pretty. Suplex! This is a pretty dangerous place to fight. Screens, exposed metal, ledges, so much could go wrong very quickly. Vicious right forearm. Intensity and anger boiling over, all coming to a head up on the stage. As we can only see, it's only getting worse by the second, Michael. He saw that one coming. And you can just feel the contempt, the venom these superstars have for each other. It's been fueling them for weeks, and they show no signs of slowing down. No signs of slowing down, even though they absolutely should. Robberies like this, they, they never end well for either party. This arena can't contain them, and if history's any indication, nothing good's about to happen up there either. Headbutt! He's burying elbows in the midsection. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Oh, tossed aside. And I think we all know nothing good comes of fighting on the stage. Case in point, nothing good happening right now. Nice suplex. Vertical suplex. Oh, man, he is fired up now. Body slam. This fight has made its way to the entranceway. Oh, man, so many things can go wrong now. Followed by the leg drop. Oh, my goodness. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. Float up. Surprise with that clothesline. Stomp in the leg. There are a lot of ways this can go sideways. Everything on that stage looks like it hurts. He's been taken hold of. Belly to belly. Vicious. Back elbow smash. Nothing fancy. Facing off on the top of the ramp. 
I don't know what's going to happen, but it's going to hurt. He deflects it right back. Plenty of ways to get creative up on the entrance area. Also plenty of ways to get yourself seriously hurt. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. In full control of their opponent with more in mind. Discus punch. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. Cranking the head. These superstars are showing no concern for their own well-being. All that matters to them right now is doing as much damage to one another as possible. Ooh. Oh, look at the squeeze. It's on like a vice grip. Oh, that just looks nasty. Oh, my God. Intensity and anger boiling over. All coming to a head the stage as we can only see it's only getting worse by the second michael <laughs> hoist it up Suplex! and once more hogan is under attack holster's certainly been in plenty of tough spots uh-oh. About the hook. Does the Hulkster have strength to recover? Tough position to be caught in here. That will do it. Not getting up from that one, so it's called. Here is your winner, The Rock. You cannot say they didn't give it their all and then some to achieve this victory. No one was willing to give even a single inch of ground in this battle. At times, it seemed like these competitors were totally deadlocked, but... All right, so another intense couple of weeks have passed in this epic rivalry between The Rock and Hulk Hogan. Next episode, we will see the massive culmination of this rivalry on SummerSlam. Trust me, it is going to be a mayhem and don't miss it. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it.